they play hard and they practice hard. The Huntsville Channel Cats hockey team works out just about every day for about an hour. J.R. Short is the team's equipment manager. He also does the laundry. Seven loads a day, two loads of underwear, two for towels, two for jerseys, and one for whatever's left. J.R. was more than willing to let me help out one day. Hey, J.R. Yep. Do you separate everything? Do you separate the colors from the whites? Not if you don't want to. All you have to do is just wash the, all the towels together, yeah. all the jerseys, and then all the underwear. And don't forget about this. Oh, jeez. It was off to the laundry room. Actually, it was off to the concrete bowels of the VBC where there's just enough room for a washer, two dryers, and some space to put folded laundry. Okay. I had everything I needed, washing detergent, stain remover, fabric softener, and this stuff. Tough duty, industrial strength, all-purpose cleaner, and the greaser. But something just didn't feel right. Wait a minute, need one more thing. <clears throat> okay, now I'm ready. It was time to start. Each player pins his long underwear and socks together so it doesn't all get mixed up. And there's one other thing hockey players do. They sweat. <laughs> the laundry felt like it had already been through the washing machine, but my nose told me otherwise. I mentioned fabric softener. Yeah, even these guys who love nothing better than to slam an opponent into the boards like their clothes to be soft. As soon as the first load finished, it was time to dry. It smells better. A lot better. Of course, when they dry, everything has to be folded and put in its proper place. After all, you don't want to make these guys mad. And now we just wait. But I'm not one to sit around and wait on laundry to dry, so I thought I'd check out the locker room. The underwear finally dried, so I put it where it needed to go in the guys' lockers. It was all snugly soft. And in case you're wondering if the fabric softener works, only on the clothes. Jerry Hayes, News Channel 19, Huntsville.